go with another first round matchup in the TPI. Former tag team specialist Ricky Shane Page taking on one half of the Irish Airborne Dave Christ. And I am joined here at the Smart Mark Video Commentator booth by making his return to AIW, SJK Sterling James Keenan. SJK Sterling James Keenan, who was unceremoniously eliminated by Isaiah Bonds because he had a handful of tights and the other handful of hair. Uh, SJK, I can see that you're still very upset about your loss earlier today. Of course I'm upset. Let's talk about this match. But looking on into this match, we see two men that are normally in tag team ranks, but Ricky Shane Page going away from the faith in nothing, quote unquote, tag team, moving on to go in a singles career. And we see one half of the Irish Airborne, Dave Christ, who we have seen go one-on-one -on -one with Johnny Gargano for the AIW absolute title, a title that you have held yourself in the past. Who do you see coming out? Who, who has that edge in this matchup moving on into the singles ranks? You know, I have to say Chris has an edge because he's got a super strong mohawk. Uh, they both have actually been very impressive. I've known both of these guys for quite a few years, and I've had battles with both of them. And uh, I can't say enough good about their in-ring ability. Ricky Shane Page might want to uh, do something about the name, though. Ricky Shane Page sounds like a boy band, not a, t not a talented wrestler like he is. It's all about marketing. Ricky Shane Page taking off the mask of Christian faith, going out on his own, not believing in the beliefs of Christian faith, wants to make his own way in this business. And what a better way to make a mark in the singles ranks. I think, he, I think Pedro, winner. I'm going to cut you off. I think he's going to make more of an impact in this business by winning this match and advancing in this tournament than taking his mask off. That being said, now that you are out of the tournament, can you give me an unbiased opinion of who you see taking it all, going all the way and becoming the TPI champion? Absolutely not. I cannot give you an unbiased opinion because I thought I was going to win this entire thing. And now Dave that Chris a with a standing moonsault, but only gets two on Ricky Shane Page. And now rolling Ricky Shane Page through. Avoiding the ace crusher up and over oh, with a back body shot into think a got, stiff kick. I don't think he got all of it. I think he grazed him, and that's co coming from that height. Anything is going to hurt, but I think he could have got more of that. Going for the cover, but Dave Chris too close to the ropes there. Ricky Shane Page is a big guy. A kick like that will put someone out of commission. That's why. I... <laughs> now, Dave Chris seeking refuge on the ropes as Ricky Shane Page closes in, pulling him up by his chin. And a series of slaps and now kicks to the thighs, trying to knot up the thigh muscles. He moves pretty well for a big man. I'll give him that. Into an ace crusher. Coming across. And oh, uh, just my goodness. A brutalizing kick to the chest of Dave Christ. Going for the he cover. Should have hooked the leg. Should have hooked the leg. He might have had him. And SJK, we've seen that all night long. Guys are failing to hook the legs, failing to tie up their opponents. Is it, is, the, is it the butterflies because of the, the, the magnitude of this tournament? The guys are just making mental mistakes in this tournament. It's possible. It means a lot. There's a lot on the line every one of these matches, but those are the kind of little, little details that you can't forget in a big money situation like this. And now, Ricky Shane Page just... Now, he's got him in the back. ropes. He shouldn't be worrying about yelling at the crowd. He should be going at him. He should be taking him down. There we go. What's going to happen here? Irish whip across. Roaring forearm misses. Again, Chris, I don't think he got all of it, but he got him down. That's all. Here we go. But, oh. Impressive pinning combination. <laughs> Barely got a shoulder up. Ricky Shane Page able to use his weight advantage over Dave Chris to get that shoulder up. This is what I'm talking about, Page. He, he showboated a little too much. Not that I've ever been guilty of anything like that. And now, Dave Chris possibly stealing Page from your book, going into an MMA style choke. Trying to choke out Ricky Shane Page. Looks like he's going for a guillotine, but he's not going to get it completely while he's got that arm hooked in there. And as you see, Page made him pay. Now Page placing Dave Christ on that top rope, possibly going up. Now oh, this could be bad. Oh no. A slice oh, red off the top rope, putting Ricky Shane Page down. Wow, there it was. <laughs> 